at the moment a uh, on agora pulse you can manage your social media content for facebook for twitter for instagram for linkedin and for youtube um we can't go live from agora pulse that's not something that you do mm. um is there any uh, plans and of course you don't have to give me trade secrets or confidential information but i know that um the founder emmerich he has really built the company on a culture of consultation with their users and you have almost like an open always on conversation where users like i and my clients and students can say hey would you ever think of doing that and that really is your roadmap for development but have you got any interesting things coming down the track you know that you can say without getting that fired. can say without getting fired yes because i've only just died um well i think what i mean just yesterday we um introduced um canva like we've been onboarding and canva integration within the app yeah. so you don't actually have to go off on canva and create your pro your your graphic and then go back into upload it it's all done within the tool and um just yesterday that we've um introduced newer sizes as well and newer resolutions and newer templates um to be included within the app so it's like introducing those things not always slowly, but it's like, you know, phasing them in just to see what does work and doesn't work. And obviously the API opening um, mm -hmm. with Facebook and Instagram has been, oh my God, long awaited. Like how long have we been waiting for this? So um, so keep an eye out for Agora Polls and it, when it comes to um, DMs and, you know, being able to access that in due course. Brilliant. Um, and we must mention the app because I know there's one listener to the show and she'll probably know who she is, but I'm not going to name her out. And I introduced her and her team to Agora Pulse. It's about three years ago, at least perhaps four. And she said that the app has changed her life. I'm so glad. Yeah, talk to us about the app and how important that is. So the app is really going through um, so much development today. I mean, today I, I was in earlier meeting, just go through um, just the on like the onboarding of how it's all changing. Um, it's really, really exciting just to be to be mobile and scheduling stuff. Like I know, like when you're at um, you're covering an event, you do not want you can't have your laptop on your lap, um, uh, air dropping pictures um, to to the Mac and then uploading it into the scheduler and like trying to make sure you get the right hashtags while the event is still happening. Um, what is brilliant about the app that is like it's it's growing every day. Um, the features are getting stronger and stronger, and the publishing tools within the um, within the app are just are just out of this world. And it looks super duper slick, and it's so much more easier to use. So we're really excited about the app and how um, it's going to keep developing um, with people. And um, I have it on my phone too, so uh, I, I'm I expect to be you know using it more and more. Yeah, it's social media management on the go. She said that, you know, it took hours off her day. She was able to go mm -hmm. to meetings and look in real time on her phone, be informed, moderate on the go. Whereas before that, she felt she had to be stuck to her desk. Yes, you know? exactly.